All right, guys, what's going on? This is Joe from Total Justice Gaming. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to our videos. We work hard to bring you guys Buddy Five videos five days a week. Uh, today's Buddy Tech is kind of really tacked on, and I'm really only doing this one because it's Power Rangers, and this week Power Rangers came out in the movies. This is one of my favorite decks, so we will hop right into it. So, first off, we run four of the Red Ranger, because what Power Ranger deck would it be if we didn't run the Red Ranger? Uh, he hits good numbers at 5-2. He's got an easy transform cost, so we run four of him. Uh, next up, we run three Oct. Uh, Oct is pretty good at a 3-1-2. He doesn't hit all the numbers we want, but his ability to get us gauge in a card when we're transformed into the turn is really, really solid. Uh, following that, we run the Green Ranger, because while Green is still okay, I would have liked to if it was 5, but then he'd just be uh, mirroring red, so he's a 4-2-2, two, two, which is okay, and he also has Transform. Uh, next up, we got Zex. Uh, Zex is a decent card, at a 3-1-5, so he's got a decent defense. Uh, he's got his ability to uh, pay two, uh, and you pay two so long as you have another Quartet 5 on the field. Uh, you pay two gauge and nullify the attack, and his transform cost is not a gauge but a life. So you can pay a life to transform and get a solid defense. Uh, next up we're running two blues. Uh, 423, decent attacker, hits decent numbers. Uh, all these guys' stats get bumped up uh, pretty soon by one of the other cards we've run. Uh, this is followed by Sabin. Uh, Sabin is a 525, which is really, really good stat, but you gotta pay a gauge to attack. Uh, so, if you need someone to sit on and you don't have Ot, but you do have him, he is a decent butt to sit on to you can so you can stall for time. Uh, we just pay two of him. Uh, we play two of nine, uh, merely for her easy gauge and her ability to uh, attack even if there's somebody in the center. Uh, at a 3-1-3, her numbers are decent at best. I would have preferred higher, but she does hit numbers when we play this guy. So we play three of the general. Uh, general command, something or other, the thing, uh, something to thousands. Five to five, so he's got the same stats as Sabin. Uh, call cost, pay, uh, transform cost of pay two gauge. Why he's so good, and he is our alternate win condition in this deck, is uh, all other uh, quartet five get plus two thousand power, meaning everybody in the deck can now hit for numbers. Uh, we hit numbers at uh, 7Ks and 5Ks and 6Ks, and everybody's crit goes up by one. So he's our alternate win condition because you can play the great, you can play a rush down, fill your field, and just keep pounding into the opponent's center until there's nothing left of them. Uh, our buddy is Combi Ranger. He is, of course, the buddy. He's a 937. You can't call him, but you do get to transform into him. Um, he gets to the nuke a monster for pitching a quartet 5, he's got penetrate, he's got a crit of 3, if you have the general out in the play zone, he becomes a crit of 4 with penetrate, he's just deadly all around, he is our primary win condition. Um, just for flavor, and guys, honestly, I'm getting ready to take this out for, uh, emergency launch drum, but I toss these two impacts just in for flavor reason, if only because... It would just, I thought it'd be really cool if I could get all nine out and do that one big attack, but I'm, after playtesting, I'm getting ready to take this dude out for emergency launch. Uh, spells, we got four I've seen through your moves. Um, typical hero world negate. We are, of course, running the hero, the Quartet 5 version. Um, we are going to be running four just as we'll prevail, and the reason why this is is because we transform so often. It means we get to, we can swing back on a monster and kill with the counterattack. And I do want to do this as much as possible because that helps me control the flow of the game uh, with the counterattack. Since unless they're playing item disruption, uh, my monster's not going anywhere when I become the monster. So this is really, really handy. 
Uh, next up, this is it's here the new suit. This lets me stonewall impact monsters and a lot of big link attacks. Uh, I get plus two thousand power, then I get an additional four thousand power. So if I'm sitting on combi, that means I get a grand total of thirteen k. So that stonewalls a whole lot of impact monsters. Uh, we are also running art three arduous training. I can pay a gauge, get real big, get a crit. So with the combination, and this is just a dream scenario, I have Combi Ranger, uh, the general, and this. Uh, I am a ridiculous size, power in 14. I got a crit of 5 with Penetrate. So that's really, really good. Uh, next up we got three searchers in uh, new program Cortex 5. This lets me go get any of my size two or lower monsters. We just get the fuel. We get uh, fuel to be able to swap into combi. Uh, we get uh, high damaging uh, units like red if we are in the general. Let's go get the general. Very, very good for this deck. Uh, gauge is not too big of an issue, so we are just running launch buddy police. Really, I optimize the deck to where you only really need three gauge to function at all times, and since we really don't need it all that much, because a lot of our monsters we call for free, or our transform cost. Once we're in combi, we don't really need to transform again. So this is just kind of like icing on the cake, or just for the heck of a card. But it gains us a free gauge and gains us a life. And then the final deck of the thing is I've come back to take you down. This lets me go fish in my discard pile for a monster and uh, go grab it and put it back on field. So if Red was destroyed or General was destroyed or it lets me reuse an Oct that was destroyed from a previous turn, it has all sorts of uses. So guys, that's my quick Power Ranger video uh, deck profile. Thank you so very much for watching, and again guys, please like and subscribe, leave comments, we read them, I love answering you guys, and as always, we work hard to bring you guys buddy fight five days a week. It's Joe from Total Justice Gaming, saying thank you again.